Ethiopia is my home, the womb I was born from. It is where I live and have done so for many years, I can barely count them. I have had many children. I am a blessed mother. They are all attached and devoted to me. There was a time when I was their primary source of nourishment. But I have been ill and weak for many years. I thought I had nothing more to offer. But my children have not abandoned me. They believe in me. And they work hard every day to give me new strength. First, I need water, and here are my children building walls and ditches to retain the precious gift of the rains. Life can sprout more easily in damp soil. New plants mean less CO2 in the atmosphere and more branches and leaves falling to the ground. As they decompose, they can fertilize the land and boost the growth of new vegetation. Then, my children want to grow a forest on the mountains. New roots will give me stability. They will retain the rainwater and carry it to the plains. The bath of the forest is a blessing and not just for me. Swarms of bees will have a new home and my children will have honey to eat and sell in the market. A tree means limitless resources. One of the most precious are the incense trees that only grow in the forests of our highlands. The same incense that has been here since time immemorial, the oldest in the world. I am the mother every village in this region is founded on and every well. I have blessed the paws of every animal. Every man has held me close. Every family has danced in my honor and prayed for a more fertile future for me. And finally, that future has arrived. 